What's up? This is Squad2440. We're following tonight to some team auto view. Today we'll be taking a look at a Chevy pickup, a few Ram flatbeds, Ram pickup flatbed, and a mower. Up first, we'll be taking a look at the all new 2019 Chevy 1500 Trail Boss Silverado. This is a brand new generation of the Silverado pickup truck, which is pretty exciting. This truck was released by Punka Dillon and his modding team. The link will be down below in the description. The truck is AO baked, it is color changeable, and you do have an option for a plow mount here. Up front. When you do look at the front end, you guys can see it does have a giant LED light bar up front, which is pretty cool. And overall, the front end of this truck is very nice. When you do come around to the sides, you guys can see the wheels do come out past the fenders, which is pretty cool. This does look to be stock Chevy wheels, which is awesome. Very nicely done here. A ton of detail to the vehicle. As you do come around to the side, you guys can see it does say Trail Boss up here, which is pretty cool. And then the back end of the pickup truck was completely redesigned does say Chevrolet across the tailgate which is pretty cool you guys can see Silverado two steps here in the bumper you do have a bumper pull hitch and you do have two square exhausts which is also very nice one very high quality model which is exciting to get here and I believe that this is the first 2019 Chevy pickup we also have here in farm soon once we hop here on the inside this has a top speed of 56 miles per hour it does have working lights and it also does have a about four straps here in the back of the bed no gooseneck and then once you take a look here at the first person view it does have an interior view but it's not too detailed which is okay the outside of this looks awesome very nicely done I do recommend you go check out his channel Dylan has released a ton of different vehicles over the last number of months which are awesome and I do feature them in a ton of videos but overall this truck handles very well and it looks pretty cool and I did get this optioned out in white because white really does showcase this truck truck very well but like we're saying it is color changeable which is awesome we'll be hopping out of this and taking a look at our first Ram flatbed which is a 2008 Mega Cab Cummins. There's many different options. You do have a plow mount attachment different wheels but you guys can see these are the semi wheels one which is pretty cool it is color changeable. You do have the option for a sander here in the back there is a tune and a few different options including the option for Cummins mud flaps. You guys can see gooseneck and bumper pull hitch along with the straps here in the bed and you guys can see it does also have wood sides which is pretty cool and it was released by McLean Modding who has released many different Rams before but I mean this truck looks pretty cool upgraded from bumper and fully extended tow mirrors but overall one very high quality mod and I really do like this a lot you guys can see pretty cool lights these are the updated lights some of my favorite lights working lights all the way around which is pretty cool when you do take a look here at the first person, you do have working tow mirrors, working steering wheel, and very nicely done, very realistic ram interior, which is pretty exciting. We'll take this for a spin to see how this handles. Within the next few mod reviews, we will be switching to my brand new map for featuring all of these mods, which should be pretty exciting. I can't wait for that. And I did get a ton of support for kind of switching over, but I would like to thank all the modders for releasing all of these pretty cool trucks. Next up, we'll be taking look at another Ram flatbed this one is a single cab and it does have the same flatbed which is pretty cool different bumper it looks like I mean that thing does look pretty cool uh, blacked out wheels which are awesome a little bit oversized but this is pretty cool two locks here in the back and you guys can see the flatbed does sit a little bit higher than it really should but overall very nicely done it once we hop here on the inside 75 miles top speed and it looks like some of the lights do work which is pretty nice and it does have two straps here in the back but you guys can see pretty cool on the first person view you do have an interior camera view but it's not too detailed we'll take this for a spin to see how it handles I am a fan of single cab trucks, they're great work trucks, and this is one pretty cool vehicle. There are a ton of new vehicles coming out with this flatbed, which is also pretty nice, since flatbeds are very versatile. You're able to put kind of pallets here in the back, tow gooseneck trailers, and a lot more with them. Up next, we'll be taking a look at another 2008 Ram, but this one is a single rear wheel long bed, and it does have the crew cab 
uh, Tomier is fully folded out, which is pretty cool. Not color changeable, but I mean, this is awesome. I mean, take a look. This looks pretty cool. Once we hop here on the inside view, 68 miles per hour top speed. It does have working lights, which is pretty cool. And then it does have a cover, but the cover is not showing up. But you guys can see all of those do work fog lights. And then on the first person view, it does have an interior view, but it does need some work. We'll take this for spin to see how this handles. You guys can see one exhaust, and there's a bit of a frame. Looks like two different frames on the underneath. This does need a little bit of work, but one pretty cool truck. Really excited to have uh, more Rams coming here into the game. If you do have any cool mods you guys would like me to feature here in these reviews, let me know down below in the description. Up next, we'll be taking a look at a very big flatbed truck. This looks to have the in-game cab with a giant flatbed here. Take a look at that triaxles, giant gas tanks. There looks to be three here on this side, bumper pull hitch. And then on this side, you guys can see it has three, so six gas tanks, which is pretty exciting. I mean, this definitely will eat up a ton of gas. Once we hop here on the inside view, it goes 51 miles per hour all of the lights do work on this which is pretty exciting you do also have extra work lights which is pretty cool now you do have an option for cover to cover up the bales as you do go around and I mean this thing does look pretty cool it actually does have a piece that does fold out which is a bit interesting why it's not we we'll definitely give it a try so let's see looks like that back piece does not really fold out on the first person view you guys can see very nicely done this actually does have eyes so let's take a look at it it looks like you could open up the door that is pretty cool that looks awesome it looks like you could also show the hydraulic which probably means that there's a front hydraulic take a look at that that is pretty cool we could also let's take a look you could uh, gate so the gate is that back part like we're saying take a look at that that's to kind of give more support in overall one very cool truck and then on the first person you could do that door and I mean overall one very cool vehicle really do like this one a lot we'll come over here we'll definitely close up this door take this for a spin but you guys can see really do like this flatbed it is very long which is perfect for hauling the bales and it does look pretty cool the final mod we'll be taking a look at today is this very cool mower. It is on the official website. Very high quality model. This thing does look pretty cool. You guys can see it does have the cutter blade, which is separate when you do purchase it. And take a look at all of the detail here on the engine side. Once you do hop on the inside, it doesn't show a person, but it goes 7 miles per hour. You guys can see the exhaust, and it does have a pretty cool first person view. So it's going to come over here, cut a little bit of grass. When you do turn it on, you guys can see, I mean, it does have pretty good engine sounds and take a look at that guys it will cut the grass which is nice you guys can see it is cutting it in and actually does drop the grass down which is pretty cool i hope you guys enjoyed today's mod review go check out all of the mods down below in the description thanks for watching have a great day and subscribe for more